I finished my first strip. Notice I started here with our gray and I went all the way down just like I showed you until I got to the brown. Um, we did the first shell of the brown. Now remember that when, just like our paper showed us, we go one, two, three, four, and then five is here, not here. Okay, so we're going to, just like we joined these, we're going to join these squares. So here on the brown, we're going to make one shell, and we're going to chain one, and then we're going to join our next square with a single crochet chain two. And two double crochets. And we're going to continue on with that square. Now, just to show you close up what I did, I have my three double crochets for my corner of the last square of my first row. Then I did a chain one single crochet join to my next square, chain two, double crochet, double crochet. Now remember, instead of doing a chain one here, we're going to do a single crochet in the last square, the brown square, that we're joining it to. Then we're going to do a shell here, and single crochet here, a shell here, single crochet here, till we get to the corner. Okay, this is our last square of our first row. For, this is our, I have uh, eight, I have eight squares. So this is square nine, 10, 11, 12, etc. Um, I've done just like we joined these. I joined the um, rust colored square all the way to, I have here in the corner, the, the corner a shell, a chain three shell. Well, it's not actually chain three because this was our join. But this is our corner of our last square of the first row. Now, I wanted to show you that before I picked it up to do any work. Now, what I'm going to do next is make, a, just like I was doing shell, single crochet, shell, single crochet. I did my shell, did my single crochet. I'm going to do a shell in this corner, one shell. Now, now we're at the joining for the two sh uh, squares, the last and the second to last square of the first row. What I'm going to do is I'm going to work a single crochet here in the middle between the two corners. Now you might want to add a chain one here before you do that, that's up to you. Um, I think I'm not going to this time. We'll see how that works out. Um, you can go in the joining or you can go around the joining, however you want to do it um, with your single crochet. Okay. Then we're going to pick up our next square and we're going to join it just like we joined all the other squares. We're going to do a single crochet, chain two, two double crochets. Now if you want to, you really, you could do just double crochet, three double crochets and skip the, the uh, single crochet there, but just for continuity, I prefer to, to continue on. Now we're going to go to our first chain one space, not this space in the corner, but the chain one space here. See, we have our corner space there, but we're not going to go into that one. We're going to go into the chain one space and make our single crochet. Then we're going to come back in this green square and we're going to do our shell. And we're going to do our single crochet and our shell in the next.
Now you might be worried about this space that's there that we left, but remember that you're going to have two rows of shells here because you're going to have the shell that comes with this row and then this square, and you're going to have a shell that comes with this square. So you're actually going to have about an inch there to catch up that space. We do our single crochet here and our three shells here. Three uh, double crochets, I should say, one shell. Crochet, shell, now we're to our last uh, corner here, so we're going to do one shell like we did on the rust colored square. Now we've done our last um, shell on our green and we're going to go into the join space here between. Not in the uh, plate, in the space between the two shells of the corner, but in between the two corners. And that's going to be our single crochet. Then we're going to join the next square. You can, as I said, you can make a double crochet directly or you can do the single crochet chain two. Once it's all said and done, it will look the same. And then we're going to go into our next chain one space. Then into our next chain one space, we'll make a shell. In our chain one space on the brown, we'll make a single crochet. And on my rust, a shell. The, the uh, piece that you are joining to the piece that's already finished, that will have your shells. The piece that's already finished will have your single crochets. did our last single crochet before in the space before the corner. Now we're going to make a corner in the corner of our square that we're joining. A shell of our first side of our corner, I should say. Then in our joining space, a single crochet. Then we have to grab our next square, which is a brown. And we're going to join that one with a single crochet chain two. And we're going to continue all down my row until we get to the first um, square of my second row, which is going to be, I don't know what number. Um, and then we'll, we'll join just as we did this. And I'll show you that in a minute.